Hello people. I'm Charlie and this is Lori. Hello. We're doing a project on the Megalodon, a giant beast or shark. And this is just for glass and so that's Megalodon it. Megalodon means enormous teeth. Its mouth can open to about 10 feet wide. Isn't that big? Well, this is big. Well, if you're making them sound like dummies, isn't that big? Yes, it is. How much numbers are on your eyelashes? Okay, continue. Uh, yes, and our hand, well, your hand. Our hand will be the size of its one tooth. So basically, if you're nom 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 on a whale. Because that, that was its food. And mostly it liked to live in warm waters and didn't really like the cold. And mostly survived in shallow waters and didn't really like the deep waters. Also, uh, also I've seen a battle between a Megalodon and Predorex. The Megalodon won. Yes. You can find pictures online. Like a Megalodon about to eat, about to eat this guy and he's like... And then the Megalodon's just like... Oh. The Megalodon like, oh. would be able, I'm pretty sure, bite into a boat. Not like any ordinary shark. Just bite into a boat and, and yeah. you'd be like... Yeah. You'd just be like, here's the boat. Okay, here's the boat. Right, here's shark. Nom, nom, nom. And here's, and here's, a, and here's Megalodon. Nom, nom, nom. Yes. Because a normal shark goes for us. Megalodon, us, and boats. And, and if the house was... And if a house was in water, I'm wrong. yeah. And if a house was in water, yeah, I'm pretty you sure wouldn't, that too. you wouldn't exist. If you say, but the megalodon is a very big, and it's a very big species. Also, we have another part of this project where we have to make an imaginary creature. Basically, it's a giant, it's a giant turtle with a black shell. Well, we can make our own ones up. Uh, okay, it's a giant turtle with a black shell that eats squids. Yeah, probably. Yeah, we're not. Yeah, we're not sure yet. And we'd like to have one as a pet. Yes, we would. It'd be so cool. Imagine someone's like, I'm, I'm going to rob this house, and then and then I just look at the window and join me, and I was like, Rawr! and they'll be like, ah, and then we just run away, and then you'll be in the tank, and then you'll rub the megalodon. Good megalodon. Yeah, megalodon. It wouldn't. It be, it's pretty big. It's a very large shark. We point that out to you. A lot. But so, if this is something you don't want to meet underwater. Like it, like if you met underwater, you'd be just, you'd, like you'd just be gone in a second. Yeah. You wouldn't even have time to pee your pants. It'd be, it'd be just like. Mm. Yes, because it would also. Some people have seen it, but some people say it's not true because it was mostly around the age I of dinosaurs. Think, I think it could still be true. Well, it's been spotted around Mongolia and then the coast of Africa. Yeah, I think it could still survive, to be honest with you. Like it the could turtles survive. and the crocodiles survived. Who's I don't see thing? any other thing that could kill a megaton. A megaton. Well, maybe an undiscovered super big awesome shark Could like you know the megalodon we don't know how many of these are there so, so um we, we there might just population be and the video's over yes. so goodbye goodbye just